Up Nation, welcome back to another video. So Fall Festival is dropping tomorrow, and I'm very excited about this one. Uh, there's four different themes we got going on. We got the players dropped today uh, over on the FIFA Mobile Twitter. Uh, so we got the players from Dave the Dead, we got the players from uh, the top transfers, uh, and including Cristiano Ronaldo. See, let's go. Um, I'm excited about that one. Uh, Messi's in there as well, some great cards uh, in that. And then we got Stream Team Jamie Vardy, which I am very excited about and if you played any of the past seasons I think you're probably pretty excited about that stream team Jamie Vardy as well uh, we didn't see the one from the Festival of Lights yet that one is still to be determined who's going to be in that but we did also get a little bit of information about this promo so we'll show you the players we'll tell you everything that you want to know um, about the promo that we got going on everything we know about the promo to this point uh, and then be sure to come join us we're going to stream uh, live we'll probably do a little bit of stream over here on YouTube in the morning and then we'll switch over to Twitch as well uh, and then lots of videos guys all those things that you love from the promos uh, so make sure to turn those notifications on also if you haven't already we've rebooted the discord stop the nation discord there's a link to that in the description below uh, make sure to come join us we're gonna run some head-to-head -head tournaments there we got a verse stack tournament coming up uh, and we're giving away discord nitro so if you like discord nitro and you want to try and win that there's that going on right now as well uh, so basically what we know about the fall festival uh, from the uh, Antoine on the FIFA mobile discord uh, also go follow that while you're, while you're there, uh, is, uh, is some of the different things we got with this one. So it kind of seems like each of the events, each of the different parts of this are going to get their sort of own, uh, different style of what you're going to do in it. Um, so basically what it says is a similar team of season where you have different league paths. So leagues unlock every few days. Um, so when you look at the team of the year, if you talk about the team of the year, uh, so going back in team of the year where we had that chance to kind of go along the path, spend some points, uh, choose the path you want, earn the players, get the points for the leagues, and then you can get those uh, to get boosted top transfer players, uh, which is kind of interesting. That's That would be like ultimate top transfer players. I don't know. I'm assuming that's what that kind of is sort of leading into, but that would be kind of cool there. And then top transfer is basically about choosing the league you want because the points you spend would be specific to that league. Uh, so many star players uh, that moved this summer, so it deserves kind of a team of the season, which is true. It's very much like, it pretty much is like team of the year, team of the season, right? So you kind of have that like uh, huge amount of high players. So lots of players you can get um, going for that one as well. So the boosted top transfer players will have different art. Uh, more info on those will be in the guide and the event drops tomorrow. Uh, but you can kind of get an idea of it. It sounds like we kind of have an idea of sort of how that's going to go, very being very similar to team of the season, team of the year uh, when you go through that. Um, and then again, uh, we got the top transfer players. So we show the top transfer players here. So we got Messi in there, uh, which is definitely very nice. Hakimi. I'm really excited actually about that Hakimi card. I feel like he could be a very decent card to have there. Sergio Ramos in there um, as well. So lots of really good cards in that one. Uh, and I love the fact that they're all wearing the new kits. Like that's one of the coolest parts about me about this promo. They have them all in their new kits, right? Like they're in their PSG kits. They're in their Man United kits. Uh, and then in the Premier League one, uh, we have Cristiano Ronaldo in there. We got Varane in there. Uh, we got that like absolutely like, Leo Bailey. I feel like he's like remember how good that card is like in every version of this card. I feel like it's gonna be absolutely unreal. Uh, in this promo as well. So lots of really good cards. So it, out of those, which top transfer players are you wanting to go for? I'm sure a lot of you are going to say Messi and Ronaldo, uh, but who else do you got on that list of cards you're going to try and get out of that one? All right, so Scream Team as well. Uh, we got Jamie Vardy in there, which is going to be a basely looking card. Uh, and so basically it, what it says is the, the side chapters like Scream Team and Day of the Dead, uh, those bring back a verse stack head-to-head -head formats from past events. So similar to sort of, I guess, how we had the maybe the midweek madness, those kind of things. I, I'm not really sure kind of what that's going on with that. Uh, but anyways, we do have some very good cards here. We got Jamie Vardy. Uh, we got ourselves Hermoso there, which would be another really beast card. Antonio in there. Uh, we got Lingard in there. Fellaini. I feel like you have to have that Fellaini Scream Team card. That's like, I'm pretty sure Fellaini has been in every single Scream Team from Season 1 of FIFA Mobile, uh, which is very nice there. And you even get to see the uh, Master card, which I kind of like the Master card. The purple actually kind of looks nice with that as well. 100 plus transfer players, which is very, very cool. So if you're looking to get a top transfer player, there are a lot of choices in there. So even though we didn't see Arsenal players, I'm very much expecting that we should be getting some Arsenal players in there. Um, there's a good chance of getting a player that you like if they moved in the past summer window. Um, and then F Festival of Light is a smaller part uh, dropping later in the event. Uh, so we're not going to see anything about that for right now. Um, but basically, the Day of the Dead promo... Um, 
These are going to be similar again to the Madness chapter that we saw in Retro. So my guess is probably what we'll get is like one week of a Madness chapter. Uh, and then you get the, the players from that. Or maybe those are like, maybe there'll be five. Actually, how many players do we have for, for that? We have one, two, three, four. There's five of them, but they're all different OVRs. So I don't know if that's like the example of one Madness chapter. Uh, cause we had those five different overalls where we only get one Madness chapter. Um, but in any event, that's what we sort of have out of that one is the Madness, uh, deal that we got there. So definitely excited about this promo. I think there's a lot going on in this promo. It is going to be a longer promo um which which is unfortunate obviously i'd like to see you know that but i think if if they do it right if it's a good longer promo i'm not too worried about being a longer promo right like i think that that's kind of when you're kind of looking at it is um if you think about it um there's 300 plus players in the whole event in this one um and there's it's a six week event so this is the big one here it's a six week event but there is a lot a lot of players and there is a lot of different things going on. So I'm excited to see what comes out of that one. Uh, but thank you for checking this out. And thank you for stopping by. It's been a pleasure as always. Stop deep.